If Gabe Grunewald were alive for her 33rd birthday, there's no doubt she'd approve of a celebratory run. I just couldn't think of any really better way to honor her and honor her legacy. Abby Anderson says her sister loved inspiring others to run. Gabe got me into running when I was really young. I always looked up to her, always will. Which is why, after watching her sister keep running professionally despite a decade of setbacks from rare cancers, Abby and the rest of Gabe's family and friends followed her funeral last week <laughs> with a run. I've gone out and ran every day since she's passed, and it's just something productive to do when you really don't know what else to do. It's hard, it sucks, but you just gotta keep on like moving and keep on being brave. Justin Grunewald says that's the thinking that inspired his wife's Brave Like Gabe Foundation, which raises money for rare cancer research. But he didn't realize the power of her inspiration until he turned to Instagram to share her final days and saw the responses start flooding in. When I read her thousands of messages and I think it was comforting for her and both for myself. And it kind of gave me extra motivation to keep her foundation going and even strive for way more. Justin, a physician, says he now plans to dedicate more time than ever to the foundation. I went into medicine to help people. I think I can even help more people doing this. And he's not alone. It's important to spread her, her life and her legacy because we can all learn a lot from it. And I think that's why she's captivated so many people. The Gabe Day celebration run starts at 615 tomorrow evening at BF Nelson Park in Minneapolis, just north of Nicollet Island. And if you can't make it, they're asking people to run wherever they are and post a photo with the hashtags brave like Gabe or hashtag running on hope. And there are some other directions that people can use uh, along with this story on care11.com. And how far are you running if you're running tomorrow? Just under 1.5 miles, 1.405. Now 1,405? was her favorite number. Don't ask why. All right, all right, <laughs> but that's the distance and what a great thing. It will be so fun. Share your pictures with us too. It will be fun to see tomorrow how many people show up or just go for a run in her honor tomorrow. Yeah. Thanks, Kent.